Letter to Santa. It was a Christmas time on the end of Sodor, and every engine was getting excited. But you can't see it because there's no snow. It's just this white carpet. And while lots of engines were busy, Percy was the busiest one. He had to take the mail to Vickers Town, and then Hero would take it up to the mainland where an airplane would take it all the way to the North Pole. But Percy was struggling. Hello, Percy. Are you struggling? No, Harold. I'm fine. Well, it seems like you're not doing very good. Snow on the tracks is no problem for me. No, but thank you for offering. Well, suit yourself. I'll keep watching from the sky. Why does that wordy bird think he's better than everyone Percy else? He couldn't help but remember the first time he met Harold. Percy and Harold had a race. Even though Percy still won, Harold likes to still tease him that he won. What's wrong, Percy? Oh, it's just all these letters. I have to take them to Vickerstown, when, where Hero takes them to the mainland, and then a plane takes them to the North Pole. And today is the last day to get the letters on time. Oh, goodness, that is a long way. I know. Well, bye, Thomas. Wait, Percy. Oh, you've forgotten your last sack of letters don't worry i can take the letters to percy after all i'm very reliable harold the helicopter hey, percy sorry harold but i'm in a hurry but percy i have some of your letters I didn't know that harold was trying to help him he just thought that he was making fun of his speed. Percy, please listen. I'll show him who's a boss. Percy! <gasps> oh no! Yes! Percy, look out! Oh no! Oh, oh no! Percy, are you okay? Yes, but why were you going after me? You had forgotten a sack of letters. Oh, well it doesn't matter anymore. The children won't get their letters now. Well, I can take them. Just load them into me. Harold the helicopter flied out the sky. But flying in the wintry weather wasn't easy for Harold either. Oh, all this snow is so hard to get through. I can hardly see where I'm going. So Harold was late with the letters, and Hero couldn't wait at Vickerstown anymore. He had to go. Wait, Hero, wait. I can't stop, Harold. I'm already late. I waited for Percy at Vickerstown. But he never arrived. That's why I'm here. I have Percy's letters for you. Aww. What's wrong, Percy? Did you deliver the letters? No. <laughs> I got stuck in a snowdrift and Harold had to take them to Hero. But he couldn't help pointing out how unreliable railways are. Oh. Well... I see. But it wasn't your fault that you got snuck in the snowdrift. It was it was the weather's fault. Anyway, people will always get um let's just say um think better of themselves. But don't worry, it will be alright. <coughs> Percy, have you heard the news? What is it, Toby? Oh, it's horrible. Harold didn't make it back last night to the search and rescue center. Oh no, I better go find out what happened to him. Percy dumped his trucks and headed off to find Harold. Harold! Harold! 
soon, Percy found Harold on the main line. Harold, what are you doing here? Oh, well, I didn't know that I wouldn't have enough fuel to get back to Sodor. Don't worry, I can help you out. But what will you do, Percy? You'll see. Anyway, one good deed deserves another. Soon, Percy came with a Christmas miracle. Percy! Thank you! But why would you do it after I said everything about you? Well, as I always say, Christmas is a time for goodwill to everyone. People, engines, and even whirly birds. Ah, ah, ah. And they had made sure that all the children on Sodor had gotten their Christmas gifts. Merry Christmas, Harold. Merry Christmas, Percy.